All right, welcome back. So first things first, let's go ahead and hop into the patch notes for LOL Miner version 1.3. Nine. So this launched seven hours ago. I will be trying to get it up and running at least on my non light or my light hash rate rig and give you guys an idea if there's any improvements there. And we've actually reconfigured one rig to only utilize the light hash rate GPUs that I do own. Here are the feature changes added support for mining ton. Use algo switch ton to mine it to mine it. Developer fee is 1.5%. AMD cards since GCN1 via OpenCL and NVIDIA cards Maxwell and newer generation via CUDA are supported. Added support for mining Ubeek. Use the UBQ hash. Ubeek's been around for a while to mine it. The fee is 0.7% as with all ET hash based coins. Now Ubeek was pretty much essentially just utilizing ET hash. It looks like they have changed their algorithm, which means, well, that how to mine you beak video from five years ago is going to need to be updated to the new version. I suppose it probably needed an update. Anyways, you beak was a project that was actually pretty interesting that I believe bits be tripping was pretty hot on in the 2016 to 2018. Um, age i guess bull run so it's kind of cool that there's some pr improvements there or some changes going on with the hash rate uh, or well hash rate algorithm i'll be curious to go ahead and check that out at some point added support for routing your stratum traffic through a sox 5 proxy server use sox 5 to enable it note at the moment this does not work with https traffic as in the ton algorithm they will work on that is what they say so here's the fixes added a timeout for doh requests so they can no longer hang indefinitely and fixed et hash support for the rx 5500 series gpus on more recent drivers Notes about the ton or ton, I don't know, ton or ton, I guess it would be ton, ton pool connection. At the moment, only the HTTPS pool communication protocol is supported. Therefore, your pool address must start with HTTPS. This protocol is not ideal for mining, but we work on, we will work on establishing a real stratum protocol with some pools in the near future. Stay tuned. Note when using a pool address starting with HTTPS, specify a port, specifying a port is optional. The default 443 is used when not specifying one. Also, when mining ton via HTTPS, LOL miner automatically uses TLS 1.2 encryption with skipped host name verification. As a final notice, always make sure your ton pool either does not need miner wallet registration or you are registered. Many popular pools require to register your wallet and address to mine it. Notes about ton performance and tuning. With regard to tuning for ton, the algorithm needs core, core, and more core. Therefore, this is interesting. Therefore, maximizing the core clock with the within the limits of your cooling and energy supply is key for ideal performance. It might be beneficial to reduce the core voltage to produce less heat and less energy consumption. This way, the cards keep more distance to their thermal limits and can often clock higher as well. We recommend this algorithm for your AMD RX 6000 cards. Holy moly, guys, this is actually super exciting. I want to take a look at TON now, or T-O-N. I don't even know what that is. So, um, and what's interesting is that it is core performance. And obviously, they're recommending the RX 6000 series because of that core performance. You could also probably see performance increases or, or good performance out of the NVIDIA GPUs. It's gonna be fun to play with regardless of essentially your opinion on whatever the project is from a technical perspective because like we always say previously, you know, the only thing that really matters is going to be your memory clock. Well, apparently uh, as far as this new algorithm and coin goes, it's actually going to be 
core clock. And so we're gonna have something different and kind of new to play with here and should actually make the mining review <laughs> videos more interesting than they have been in the past. Now, obviously it sounds like I'm having some issues with kiddos in the background. I may have to go help mama out here in just a second. I'll wait and see if she pings me, but uh, apologies if there's any bleed through there. It's part of being a parent, so it is what it is. But that's definitely uh, super cool. I actually might start Googling it here at the end and see what's going on with it because I have never heard of it. Actually, let's go ahead and hop into it right now. Uh, I don't even want to know how to mine it. I want to know what it is, but let's go ahead and look if the internet will work here. Read the full article on Medium. Does he give us an overview? Okay, so it's the open network. Ton, these are ton apps. There is a mining calculator up now. Here we go. So here's the price. $3.73. Is this the official website? Here we go. Ton is a third generation proof of stake blockchain design in, designed in 2018 by Dur the Durov brothers, the founders of Telegram Messenger. Later it was handed over to our open Ton community. Uh, which has been supporting and developing it ever since. I'm a little, okay, so they, but they do have mining. Are distributed via a special giver smart contract, which uses proof of work mechanism. That way, by checking proofs, we can estimate how much computational power is used for coin extraction and how to mine. Here's the quick guide. Now, obviously, we can now mine it with something else. Uh, with LOL Miner, what did they originally? They had their own uh, miner, it looks like here. Oh, this documentation's pretty good. So they got all the information. I'm going to deep dive this later, guys, and we'll get a video out on this, this project here. Uh, it looks promising. Um, seeing that it was originally started by the Telegram dudes. And I definitely want to throw on a, <laughs> I want to throw a rig on this for sure. What, uh, what exchanges are they on? Let's see if that info is here. All right, exchanges, FTX, OK, EX, EXMO. Wallet bot, Neo Crypto, Pancake Swap, Uniswap, Crypto Bot, Dodo, and Gate.io. And then you can mine and stake as well. Cool. All right. A new project to look into that uh, we found out through basically the new LOL Miner version 1.39. So that's really neat. I think I'm excited for this one. New year, new coin, sort of new coin to take a look at. I hope you enjoyed this clip from the Crypto Mining Morning Show every Monday through Friday, 7.45 a.m. Pacific and 10.45 a.m. Eastern Time. You can check out more clips here, or if you're interested in checking out the entire live show, you can check that out down here. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next Tuesday.